Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another listening practice video for you. We're going to be listening to a woman talk about what she wants in her new house. My name is Karen and on my channel I help you bridge the gap or close the gap between the English that you learn in the classroom and the English that's actually used in real life. Today, we're actually going to be listening to a conversation between a man and a woman, but the woman pretty much speaks the entire time. The man only says one word, I think. <laughs> so the focus today is really on what the woman is saying. The woman is building a house and she's talking about the three things that she wants in her new house. So my question for you today is what are the three things that she wants in her new house? And then after you listen to the conversation, we can then study some of the things that she says today. Okay, let's go. There's three things that I really want. I want you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from... Somewhere. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, I want a, a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. There's three things that I really want. I want you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from... Somewhere. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, I want a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. There's three things that I really want. I want you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from... Somewhere. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, I want a, a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. There's three things that I really want. I want you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from... Somewhere. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, I want a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. There's three things that I really want. I want, you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hue and pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from somewhere. Yeah, exactly. And um, I want a, a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the focal point. Now let's talk about some of the things that she said today. The first thing that she said was, there's three things that I really want. There's three things that I really want. Now, I've mentioned in previous videos that native English speakers don't always use the correct grammar. And this is a perfect example. As you probably know, the correct way to say this is there are three things that I really want. There is one thing. There are three things. But it's very common to hear there's three things because it is so much easier to say there's than there are. It just rolls off the tongue that much more easily. And to roll off the tongue is an idiom and it just means easy to say or pronounce. So there's is much easier to say than there are. So this is more common in casual conversation, when you're more relaxed, you don't want to work so hard, so you just say, there's, there's three things. But like I've also said in previous videos, please use the correct grammar and don't follow the bad habits of native English speakers. I just want to let you know that you will hear these sorts of things in real life. 
And then she starts listing the things that she wants. And the first thing that she wants is, I want this handmade or beautiful bathtub. I want uh, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub. Handmade. This is an adjective and you can probably guess what it means. It means made by someone using their hands, not made by a machine. Some people like handmade things because someone took the time to make something for you. So it could be quite unique. It's the only one that exists. So it's something special or different. And she wants her bathtub to be handmade. Now bathtubs are quite big and they don't look very easy to make. So I'm guessing that if she wants a handmade bathtub, it's going to cost her a lot of money. Bathtubs can be made from different types of materials. She said that she wanted her bathtub to be made from hewn pine or some other type of local timber. Made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. Now timber is a type of wood that you use to build things like houses, boats, chairs, tables and I think in the US they might call it lumber but in Australia we say timber. So she wants her bathtub to be made from some type of local timber and she mentions a particular type of timber tree the Huon pine, which actually only grows in Tasmania where she lives. And Tasmania is one of the states in Australia. Down at the bottom, that little island down there is Tasmania. So she wants her bathtub to be made from either Huon pine or some other type of local timber. And the last thing she says is I want a fireplace rather than a TV as the focal point. I want a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. This is a fireplace and this is also a fireplace. So it's just somewhere where a fire can burn in the house. And usually fireplaces are found in the living room. So she wants a fireplace rather than a TV as the focal point in her room, I'm guessing her living room. And the focal point is the thing that everyone looks at, the most interesting thing or the most important thing. So she wants a fireplace to be the most interesting thing that everyone wants to look at when they walk into her new home. So what are the three things that she wants in her new house? The first thing is a handmade or beautiful bathtub that's made from some type of local timber. The second thing, she wants to be able to see the stars. It doesn't have to be from the bathtub, it could be anywhere in the house. She just wants to be able to see the stars. And the third thing, she wants a fireplace, not a TV, to be the focal point in her house. Okay, we learned a few different things today and I have one last question for you. What one new thing did you learn from today's video that you're going to try and use now? Let me know in the comments below. Let's listen to the conversation one last time at the normal speed and see how much more you can understand this time around. There's three things that I really want. I want you know, this, this handmade or beautiful bathtub made from hewn pine or some kind of natural local timber. I want to be able to see the stars at night, whether it's from the bathtub or from... Somewhere. Um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, I want a fireplace rather than a TV screen as the, the focal point. Please give me a thumbs up if you found this video useful so that I know to make more videos like this one for you. Thank you for watching today. Keep practicing, stay safe out there, and I shall see you next time. Bye.